What is DSPS? DSPS stands for Disabled Students, Programs, and Services. Who does DSPS serve? DSPS serves students with many types of disabilities, including physical, mental health, or learning disabilities. What types of services does DSPS provide? DSPS provides academic adjustments and auxiliary aids that are decided through an interactive dialogue between you and DSPS professionals. Appropriate academic accommodations are based upon your documented disability and its impact on you in a learning environment. The goal of academic adjustments and auxiliary aids is to create equal access to educational programs and other college offerings. What types of adjustments or accommodations are available? Examples of common accommodations include assistive technology, textbooks and other materials in alternate format, additional time on tests in a quiet setting, adaptive equipment and furniture, access to tutoring, academic counseling, note-taking assistance, sign language interpreting, and more. How do I qualify for DSPS? After applying with Yuba College, make an appointment with a DSPS specialist. Make sure to bring verification from a medical professional or appropriate specialist to this appointment. What kind of documents are acceptable for verification? DSPS medical verification form, letter from a doctor or licensed professional, IEP from a high school, or a 504 plan. What if I don't have documentation? It may still be possible that you qualify based on other criteria. Is my disability information confidential? Yes, it is confidential, and it is not released to anyone outside the accommodation process. DSPS will not disclose a student's specific disability with faculty members. Are DSPS accommodations the same as high school? No, the services of the community college are different than high school. In college, students are responsible for requesting accommodations and services for themselves. In addition, instructors do not modify curriculum. DSPS students are held to the same academic standards as all other students. Do I have to reapply and bring in disability information every semester? No, but you do need to make an appointment with a specialist at least once a year to make sure you have what you need. Services like this, like DSPS on the campus, are very important and vital to students who have disabilities and who are intimidated about going back to school. I'm always telling people, hey, go see DSPS, go see DSPS, because it's an amazing program and it's something that's really needed, I feel, for every campus. DSPS is a great student support program that helps students get accommodations to make sure that they meet their full potential. Um, they're really like a family away from your family. I think students, if they qualify for services, should come in and see a counselor as soon as possible. Because the sooner you um, are able to get the services, the easier your time in college will be. I always tell my student if they are struggling with their academics, don't hesitate just to go to the DSPS office, check if any of those services they can provide for you. I want to inspire women around the world and I love the inspiration and the support that DSPS gives me so that I can do that. Oh, I love DSPS. <laughs> Thank you so much for taking a few minutes to learn more about disabled students, programs and services. Our goal is to partner with you to ensure access along your educational journey. So welcome to DSPS, where our focus is always on your ability. We focus on your